Oh, hey, party people. Today, we are at a rock concert on a Spanish island. How cool is that? We are on the island of Gran Canaria, part of Spain's Canary Islands. And they're having a huge rock concert today. What's a Spanish rock concert like, you ask? I'm so glad you asked. Well, it's kind of like a rock concert in America, except, as you may have suspected, all of the music is in Spanish. <laughs> and it's not that great. I right, listen, I don't know any of the songs. If you know the songs, obviously you're going to enjoy the concert more. But I feel like if you hear a really amazing song... You like it a little bit the very first time you've heard it. And I didn't get a lot of that at the concert. I was like, all right, it's a catchy tune. But nothing where I was like, wow, this is amazing. I remember the first time I heard Fetty Wap, Baby Won't You Come My Way, in a little bar slash almost nightclub in Newport Beach. And Fetty's like, yell singing baby won't you come my way I was like what is this what who is this angelic voice I am listening to <laughs> but it, you know what I'm saying it hooked me immediately nothing here has hooked me immediately but hey all these people are here they're all enjoying the show hola Matthew como estamos Matthew encantado muy bien hola que tal Look at that, I'm making new friends. Look at the crowd, they're very into it. Everybody's in a good mood. Unlike a concert in America, I was at this show for like two or three hours. I didn't see one fight. I didn't see one person so drunk they were falling down. I didn't see one girl holding another girl's hair so she could throw up in the corner. Like, obviously, these Spanish people are drinking, but they seem to be able to keep it under control. Unlike the United States, unlike England, Great Britain, unlike Australia. I don't know what's going on with our Northern European gene people, but we seem to have a problem handling our alcohol. Spanish people drink, but just not at that level like they do in the States. Oh, look, it's my friends. The concert's be being put on by uh, one of the local, I don't know if you call it breweries, distilleries that makes a very popular rum. So it's called the Rum Festival or Rum Party. Let's listen in to my tonterias. Let's see what, what we're talking about here. Guapos, guapos toros, guapos toros. Guapas toros, guapas toros. They are guapos toros. They definitely are. I mean, you gotta admit that stage setup is pretty impressive. We're actually in the city of Arucas on the island of Gran Canaria. We're not in the capital in Las Palmas. Ranucas, Arucas is Ranucas. Arucas is like a little mountain town. Uh, it's only, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes from the, from the coast, maybe 10. But it's not a beach town. It's a little town up in the mountains. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I would never live there if I was in the Canary Islands because if I'm in the Canary Islands, I want to be at the beach. But the Canary Islands are awesome. The island of Gran Canaria, they call it a mini continent. And, and it, it really is. It's got the beaches. It's got mountains. It's got a little dry, high desert inland section. It's got a little interior that gets a lot of rain because it catches the clouds. 
Ah, look at this, everybody getting into the show, doing the hand wave. Look at that crowd. Great place to have a concert. But I have a little bit of a love-hate relationship with the Canary Islands. I love the Canaries. It's an absolute paradise. The climate is ideal, like the only place I've ever lived where it's even a little bit better than Southern California. Very similar. Super dry. The landscape is not green and lush. It's like dry mountains rolling into the sea, just like California. Even a little bit warmer in the winter, even a little bit less rain. They are prone to Kalimas, which is a giant dust storm that rolls over from the Sahara. There seems to have been a lot more of those in recent years. But apart from that, pretty perfect. Never going to have earthquakes, never going to have hurricanes. Basically no natural disasters except for those Kalimas. But every time I go to Canary, my dating life takes a hit. So I think I'm going to stick a pin in Canary and put that in my return to when you have a wife or girlfriend category. I mean, we could be in California right now. If I didn't tell you we're in Spain, you'd never know. Hasta la próxima, chicos.